This guide shows you how to do an update on your iPad if there's a software update available. Now usually this is denoted by a number just in the top right hand corner of your settings cog icon just here. But that could equally mean that there's a message as well waiting for you to action. So uh, the, the number in the top right hand corner basically denotes something needs doing. So if you see a number up there, then like I say, it could be a message that needs actioning or it could be that uh, your iPad needs an update. So all you do is just tap on the settings cod and then just follow the number basically. So there's the number one there. So just tap the number one there and there's a number one by software update there. So I'm just gonna tap the number one just there and it now says it's checking for updates. And there you go, it tells me there's an update available and it said iPad OS 14.4. So all I do is I just tap install now and here it asks you to enter your passcode if you've got a passcode to get into your iPad. It might always also ask you to uh, touch the button on the front of the iPad. So I'm just gonna type in my code. And there we go, I've typed in my code and it's now verifying the update. So uh, at this point, it might also download the update. So it might take a while. So uh, please be patient with it. What I'm gonna have to do is I'm, I'm gonna have to pause this video, otherwise the video will be about 20 minutes long. So the iPad is now restarting. Uh, it's just gone black at the moment. That's why you've got a black screen up there. And there you go, you've got the picture of the Apple just briefly appeared and the screen's gone blank again, the apples come back and this is gonna happen a few times. You know, you're gonna see an apple appear and then disappear. And there we go, we've now got a line just going, a white line, just going up to the right, very, very, very slowly beneath the apple. I mean, in actual fact, it's difficult to tell whether it's actually moving towards the right or not. I think it is. But uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to pause this video because this part is going to take a long time. And uh, we'll come back to it in a few moments. OK, so about three and a half minutes has gone by. And as you can see, the white line hasn't got very far. So this is going to take quite a while to uh, update. So just be patient with it. Don't try and interfere with the update. Just leave it. I'm going to pause this video again and we'll come back to it in a little while. OK, so the line has just shot up to the end really quickly, as you saw there, and the iPad's turned itself off. Now, don't panic, don't touch it at this stage, because there you go, it's coming back on automatically, like I say, throughout the update process. Don't touch any buttons on your iPad whatsoever. Just leave it. So we've got the Apple come up on the screen at the moment. And there we go, the line has come back again. And the line, hopefully, is filling up a little bit faster this time than what it did do the, uh, the first time. As you can see already, you can see the white actually moving up towards the right. So again, just be patient with it. It's going to take a little bit longer. I'm going to pause this video and we'll come back to it once it's nearing the end. And the line has just disappeared, as you just saw there. And we've just got the Apple logo up on screen. And here we go, it's now asking for my ID. So I'm just gonna type my four digit code in. And there we go, the iPad has updated. And as you can see there, there's no, no longer a number to the top right hand corner of the settings cog. So the iPad has updated. But if you wanna double check that, just tap the settings cog tap general and then tap software update and it will check for updates and there you go. It now tells me my software is up to date and all I've got to do is just press the button on the front of the iPad to go back to the main menu. So there you go, that guide showed you how to update your iPad to the latest version of the iOS. Hope this guide helps, thanks for watching. You can follow me on Twitter at CWTech that's at CW Tech on Twitter. And don't forget to check out my other videos in my YouTube channel. Just Google Chris Waite YouTube. And don't forget to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you for your support.